Well, Nick, welcome to Durham. How pleased are you have joined the club? Yeah, very excited to be here. Um, settled in in the last week and got to know a few of the guys that I hadn't met before. So yeah, really excited for what's to come. And the first opportunity for you to play in the county championship. How did this move come about? Uh, just spoke to Northy back in the Australian summer, and um, you know we've had history of playing together. And he just said um, they're looking for someone to come over, and if I was interested, it was replacing Keegan, and um, just went from there. And yeah, obviously really excited to be here and. Um, getting to know everyone and the ground's beautiful so can't wait to play. You mentioned Marcus North there, Derry have got a tradition of bringing Australians over to play play for the club. Did you speak to any of them, those guys ahead of, ahead of this move to Derry and what did they say about the club? Yeah well obviously John Hastings is a favourite round here so um, chatted to him as well and also Michael Divinuto from um, a bit longer ago now but yeah chatted to him recently about his time at the club and um, he couldn't have spoke more highly of the, of the, of the club so yeah really excited to be here. And you're going to play for Durham in the County Championship and the Royal London One Day Cup. What can the Durham members expect to see from you over the next few months? Um, what can they expect? Uh, hopefully some positive cricket. Um, yeah, obviously you'd like to come here and make an impact on the team and contribute to some wins. So that's that's my goal and that's why I'm here. But ultimately is to help Durham um, get as high up in the standings as we can in the County Championship and also in the Royal One Day Cup and try and win a white ball uh, trophy for the club. And you joined Durham on the back of that Australia Air Tour in Sri Lanka. How did you find that experience over there? Yeah, it was a really nice tour. Um, three or four weeks over in Sri Lanka and got to play both some red and white ball in conditions that are a little bit foreign to, to many Australians. So um, being over there for some four-day cricket was, was excellent and you know, getting to play spin and just a different mindset about the game is really, uh, really good and to hopefully improve my game the older I get. You've been here a week or so now. How have you settled in? How have you found the lads? And how have you found the, the training over the last couple of days? Yeah, it's been wonderful to be here. I went away with the T20 guys over the weekend last week and you know, got to meet a few of the guys I didn't know and everyone's been very welcoming and extremely warming. And um, yeah, it feels like a great place to be and I can't wait to play cricket with everyone. I just thought I'd ask you, the lads have been talking about your tattoos in, in, <laughs> in training. Yeah, right. You've got a fair few on show. How many have you got? What's your favourite? And have you got any, any lined up in the future? Uh, Sometimes I just decide before I walk in there, but um, yeah, over the journey of, of playing and traveling around the world, there's different things that I got some inspiration from. Um, my favorite one is the one I got for my my soon-to-be wife um, on my arm, and she'll kill me if I didn't say that one. So um, yeah, that's probably one of my favorites, but yeah, nothing uh, nothing planned while I'm here, that's for sure. And just finally, Maddo, we're getting to action on Monday against, against Derbyshire. How much are you looking forward to that and putting that Durham shirt on for the first time? I, I'm really excited, obviously, wanting to come over and play in the county championship for a, for a long time and I'm really thankful for the opportunity that Durham have given me to be able to, to do that. And like I said, I'd love to contribute to, to some wins and, um, and do well for the club while I'm here and um, I, I'm really excited.